This video will cover how to find the measure of angles using central inscribed angles. Angle X is 80 plus 20 over 2 and 100 over 2 is 50 degrees. Angle Y equals 80 minus 20 over 2 equals 60 divided by 2 is 30 degrees. Now let's check if this answer is correct. The first one use the central and inscribed angles. The central angle is a twice inscribed angle subtended by Seymark. In here, the central angle is 80 degrees subtended by this arc. That means this arc, the central angle is 80 degrees. So subscribed angle is 40 degrees by the same arc. That means if we connect these two points, then this angle is 40 degrees. Like this. Use the same technique. Subtended by this arc, the central angle is 20 degrees. That means the central angle is 20 degrees. So inscribed angle is 10 degrees. That means this angle is 10 degrees. Now we use the external angle theorem. If angle A and B, this angle is A plus B. Then from here, the shape is like this. This angle is 40 degrees. This angle is 10 degrees and x, use this formula, x equals 40 degrees plus 10 degrees, which is 50. The second one, draw the segment here. Then can you see, subtended by this arc, the central angle is 80 degrees, that means this inscribed angle is 40 degrees. And subtended by this arc, the central angle is 20 degrees. That means inscribed angle is 10 degrees. Then use your external angle theorem. This angle is Y, 10 degrees, 40 degrees. Then y plus 10 degrees equals 40 degrees. That means y equals 30 degrees. Now, let's make it a formula that's easy to remember. The first one, angle x equals angle A plus angle B divided by 2. The second one, angle y equals angle A minus angle B divided by 2. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment below. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.